ABC General Hospital spoilers for Friday, August 16th tease that Sonny has vowed to protect Christina at all costs, and this has led to a major plan taking shape between father and daughter. Recognizing the threat posed by Ava's actions, Sonny and Christina decide that they won't just sit back and endure, but will instead take proactive steps to confront the situation. They begin crafting a strategy to turn the tables, targeting the very secrets and schemes that Ava has orchestrated. With determination and careful planning, Sonny and Christina meticulously prepare to expose the crimes Ava has committed while also safeguarding their family from any looming threats. Supported and guided by Sonny, Christina is no longer the vulnerable daughter she once was. She has become a formidable ally, ready to stand by her father as they face the challenges ahead. Their plan isn't just about revenge. It's about reclaiming control and protecting the family's honor. They understand that to win, they must act smartly and decisively, leveraging every advantage they have. With a clear goal and strong family unity, Sonny and Christina are ready to confront Ava in a battle where only one side can emerge victorious. Meanwhile, Laura was having a quiet afternoon when she unexpectedly received a phone call from Lucky, her son, who had been away for many years. Emotions surged within her as she heard his voice, but the joy of reunion was quickly replaced by a deep sense of anxiety. Lucky's tone wasn't what she had expected. It was heavy, laden with sorrow. As he began to speak, Laura's heart sank, realizing that this call wasn't bringing good news, but rather a message of pain. Every word Lucky spoke felt like a dagger to Laura's heart, making it almost impossible for her to breathe. She tried to remain composed, but the growing anguish became too overwhelming to contain. The call ended, but the sense of loss and heartache lingered, weighing heavily on Laura's soul and plunging her into a state of inescapable despair. Molly and TJ are facing an incredibly heartbreaking decision as they choose to sue Christina for involuntary manslaughter in the death of their child. This isn't just a difficult step to take. It also isolates them and places them under immense pressure from family and friends. While they understand that pursuing legal action against Christina might bring justice for their lost child, they can't escape the feelings of guilt and internal conflict that come with confronting a loved one. The decision has sparked a wave of intense reactions from their family members, who criticize Molly and TJ for choosing the legal route instead of seeking reconciliation and healing through family bonds. Relationships that were already complex have become even more strained, as everyone in the family is forced to take sides in this conflict. Molly and TJ are not only dealing with the grief of losing their child, but also the anger and betrayal from those they love. This decision has thrust them into a painful battle, not just because of the loss they are enduring, but also because of the upheaval in their family dynamics. They know there's no way to return to how things were before, and everything has now changed forever. Regardless of the outcome of the lawsuit, Molly and TJ realize they will have to live with the consequences of this decision for the rest of their lives. Jason has just achieved a major victory by uncovering evidence that links John to Christina's fall. This discovery not only confirms long-held suspicions, but also puts Jason in a position of power, ready to take action. With the evidence in hand, Jason prepares for a powerful counterattack. He knows that exposing the truth about John is not only about seeking justice for Christina, but also about protecting his family from any further threats. Jason begins planning meticulously, step by step, to ensure that every move he makes is precise and leaves no room for error. Each of his actions is carefully calculated to catch John off guard, who has no idea that his secrets have been exposed. This confrontation is not just a physical battle, but a psychological one, as Jason uses all the information he has to put John at a disadvantage. The outcome of this counterattack will not only determine John's fate, but also solidify Jason's role as a strong, unyielding protector of those he loves. John has carried out a shocking arrest, finally achieving the goal he has long pursued, putting Sonny behind bars. After months of surveillance, gathering evidence, and waiting for the right moment, John has everything he needs to bring down the powerful kingpin of Port Charles. The arrest happens quickly and dramatically, leaving the town in shock. 
Sonny, who was once untouchable, is now handcuffed and taken away in front of the entire community. For John, this is a moment of triumph after years of being haunted by the task of bringing Sonny to justice. He has been patient, carefully plotting each step to ensure there was no escape for Sonny this time. However, even though he has reached his goal, John knows that putting Sonny in jail is not the end of the journey, but the beginning of a new battle. Sonny's loyalists will not let this go easily, and Port Charles may never be the same again. But for now, John has succeeded in doing what few could have imagined, putting Sonny Corinthos, one of the most powerful men in town, behind bars.